And they're off and racing. The forerunners jumping away. The Boodles, Chester Vars, then early stages. And the intention from Ryan Moore clear for all to see. He desperately wanted the lead. Shakes the reins at changing of the guard early. And the horse responds immediately to go four or five lengths clear of the three chasers in behind. So changing of the guard sets the rapid tempo early on. New London sits in second place. Savvy victories on the outside, and that means that Berkshire Rebel is the early back marker as they move round into the home straight for the first time. So changing of the guard had, has established a pretty big lead over the other three. Question will be when William Buick decides to try and close on New London, who's currently six lengths back. In the outside, Savvy Victory comes next. He's a length and a half further behind. And last of all is Berkshire Rebel as New London just uh, nudged along briefly coming round the bend there, away from the winning line, changing of the guard out in front still. So Ryan Moore on board, swings round with seven furlongs left to go in this fascinating Boodle's chest of ours. Changing of the guard by about four now. New London second, followed then by Savvy Victory on the outside of Berkshire Rebel. Moving on then towards the six pole. Passing that, still changing of the guard, the runaway Dundalk winner from the unbeaten New London, who's three lengths back in second place. Savvy Victory, the Pontifrac winner on the outside, and Berkshire Rebel still at the back of the field, coming past the five pole. Changing of the guard from New London, who's as close now as he's ever been. The gap between them is barely two lengths now, with Berkshire Rebel on New London's tail, and Savvy Victory toward the outside. As they come now past the half mile marker, changing of the guard, Ryan Moore is helping him along every step of the way, trying to put New London under pressure. New London himself squeezed up on the outside now. Savvy Victory and Berkshire Rebel are now both ridden. Indeed, they're all ridden in behind changing of the guard at the moment. New London will have to find something here. Changing of the guard doesn't look in the mood for stopping. New London comes under pressure, hangs in behind slightly. Are we about to get a big turn up here? Because changing of the guard comes into the home straight, still in front, and New London is showing no signs yet of closing the gap. Savvy Victory back in third, then Berkshire Rebel down to the final furlong here. Changing of the guard is three in front of New London in second place. These two well clear. Aidan O'Brien starts Chester's May meeting in style. He won the Oaks, but this one, changing of the guard, romps to victory in the Boodle's chest of ours. He's five or six lengths clear. Bubble bursts for New London. He was a well-beaten second. Savvy victory and Berkshire Rebel, the next one's home. Changing of the guard, but it's not really, is it? Because Ryan Moore wins this for the eighth time and Aidan O'Brien for the tenth.